What's up YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Investor Josh and every single day I bring you new videos with content in what I consider are the best cryptocurrencies and stocks to invest in the market today. I've been investing in the stock market successfully for over 13 years now and I first invested in Bitcoin back in 2013. So if you want to earn massive gains potentially, come along, join me on this journey. Scroll down right now please, hit that subscribe button, leave comments if you'd like to be interactive and of course give us a thumbs up if you'd like and uh, I'm going every day bringing new content in what I consider are the best cryptos and stocks in the markets. Now today, I wanna to talk to you specifically about one coin and a little bit about a few others. This is a top coin, is very popular. A lot of people are invested in it, including myself, and I think it still has a lot of room to move up this year, potentially making some massive gains. That coin is ADA, ARA, Cardano, however you'd like to say it. It has a lot of room to move ahead of it. We already have a big movement over the last few months. We saw it go from below a dollar, sitting around the 80 cents mark, to pushing beyond a dollar, well beyond a dollar, up until I think around the dollar 30, dollar 40 markets hit. We'll have a look at some charts specifically in a second. But Cardano's done some good things. I'm talking US. And currently is sitting around a dollar 11 US which I think is a good buying opportunity. If it sits, if it goes down even further, if it hits a dollar mark or below a dollar, I think, because as I've stated earlier, we are in a bull run, I believe this bull run, run will continue. I believe that would be an excellent buying opportunity. Obviously, this is all for entertainment purposes only. None of this is financial advice. Please do your own due diligence. Please do your own research on everything you invest in. This is my personal opinion only. These are coins and cryptos and stocks that I'm invested in. So Cardano, I think, has a lot of room to move. I think we should easily see a $3 target before the end of the year, easily. Potentially, depending how hard the bull market pushes, potentially up to $10. Obviously, that would be a great gain from where we are now. We'd be looking at almost a 10X if it made it to $10. But that's that's in the, that's the longer term or midterm. That's what I'm talking year 2021, this year we're in. So I think easily a $3 Cardano, as I said, we're sitting at $1.11. So that's an excellent, uh, excellent return on investment. And uh, it's just doing big things. We're going to have a look at some charts in a second. But before we do, I'd like to remind you all, there's some links down below for free money. Uh, if you'd like to join up and trade stocks on eToro, I have a link down there for free between 50 to 100 US dollars, depending on where you live. They trade the big cap, uh, big cap cryptos over there. So you've got Bitcoin, Ethereum, uh, Cardano, ADA. We've got Litecoin, uh, Dash. TRX, XRP, all those are over at eToro. So all you've got to do, uh, depending where you are, for most of the world, is deposit and trade 100 US dollars, and you will get 50 free US dollars to deposit and trade that. And if you live in Qatar, some countries around there, deposit 100, you get 100. Here, if you live in Australia, you deposit 200 and trade 200, you'll receive 100 US dollars for free. So that is my eToro link down below. Also, if you know nothing about trading, you can simply just hit the copy trade and you'll be copy trading all of my stocks and cryptos within that account. So that account over there at eToro, that is my public trading account, which I publicly have my stocks and some cryptos over there. For the most part, I trade cryptos on Binance and and uh, PancakeSwap for the most part. Um, I also have links down there for Australians for coinspot.com.au. You use my link, you get $10 for a free Bitcoin. And Stake, if you just want to trade stocks with a huge amount of stock options down there, it is uh, a free link for a free stock of either Dropbox, GoPro, or Nike. Now we're going to hit up these charts. Let's have a look at Cardano and a few other coins that I'm really bullish on. We're going to go over to Coin Market Cap. Let's check it out. So moving over to Coin Market Cap, we have the big boy at fifty thousand dollars, two hundred and fifty thousand, two hundred and four dollars up, zero point five eight percent for the day. We have Ethereum. Now, what I want to speak to you today about is Cardano, but coins I'm bullish on in the top ten, top twenty. And outside of the top 20, all right? So for, for short-term gains within the next few months, uh, say three, three to six months potentially, and then more longer-term gains outside of that, okay? So obviously there's Bitcoin, but out, before we talk about Bitcoin, I want to speak to you about Ethereum. 
Within the top 10, I am bullish on Ethereum, very much so, way more bullish on Ethereum than I am on, than I am on Bitcoin. I think Ethereum will have much larger percentage gains over Bitcoin as it has done for, for a good period of time now. If you go back and look at charts, and I've posted these on YouTube before, but you can easily do it yourself. Go on to Google, have a look at the past six months, have a look at the past year, and look at the Ethereum's gains over Bitcoins. They are much larger in percentage. And that will continue. So Ethereum, I am bullish on. I am bullish on Binance Coin. I have a good chunk of my uh, cryptos tied up, as far as top 10 cryptos tied up in both Ethereum and Binance. And Cardano, as I spoke about, Cardano, ADA, ADA, sitting at number seven. I am bullish on that. We're currently down 0.38%. It's sitting at $1.12 US. Now, I think it's a good buying opportunity, potentially, as we drop lower, potentially, if we do drop lower, I think we'll have an excellent buying opportunity for Cardano at a dollar or below a dollar, if you believe we are staying in a bull market, as I do. And uh, Uniswap, bullish on that. Polkadot, I mean, there's not much I'm bullish on. I mean, let's let's talk about it, all right? So, so if I had to pick, say, five out of the top ten in in uh, for this year, what I think can do biggest percentage gains, I would say I would say Cardano, potentially Cardano or Binance. Binance Coin is excellent, really is excellent. I I, th I see that going places with the pancake swap with everything that is got going on right now. Uh, Binance Smart Chain, it is steamrolling. But we have run up a lot with Binance in recent times, and we made excellent profits. If you're watching some of my earlier videos and invested in Binance with me, you along with me, well over, made 100% of your, you've doubled your money easily, easily, if not more. So Binance, I'm still bullish on. Uh, Ethereum, I'm bullish on. Cardano, I'm bullish on. Uh, Uniswap to a degree later in the year when when Ethereum uh, uh, layer two comes out, that will be do great things. And Litecoin, so I mean, I mean, there's Cardano. In order, Cardano, Ethereum, and Binance, Litecoin. Uniswap. There's my five for the top ten. Um, and it's tough because Polkadot's going to do great things too. I mean, the, the only thing, I mean, you've got Dogecoin, which is ridiculous. Up up 19.78% is a meme coin. But, I mean, there's money to be made there. There's money to be made. Set your stop losses. Be careful. It could dump at any second. It's got no good fundamentals behind it. It's preposterous, to be honest with you. But there's money to be made. Set your stop losses. Be careful. If we go outside of the top 10 and we want to look at, uh, say, 11... Bitcoin Cash, not really. Chainlink, very bullish on that. V Chain sitting at number fourteen. So there's two in the in the and Sol is had a run up and it's continued. Look at that, nearly nineteen percent today. Can you go wrong at Sol? I don't know. I don't know if you can go wrong with Sol. To be honest with you, I think it's easily going to retract. Well, it's going to hit that fifty, no problem, sometime very soon. Uh, and then again, you're looking at V Chain, a bullish on that. Um, Theta. Stella, to some degree, not not as much as the others, not as much as Chainlink and VeChain. So, Tron had one of the most bullish looking charts in cryptos just two weeks ago, and uh, and then the crypto market, as we all know, dumped recently. It could come back. We could see massive percentage gains on Tron again. We are up uh, 0.31%. I see the market coming back. The stock market came back on the last day of trading. The crypto market is now coming back, in my opinion. So that's for the top 20. We are there with... Uh, so I'm, I'm bullish in the top 20. I'm bullish on Chainlink, Solana, VeChain, and uh, Feder and Tron. That's for my top 20. Outside of the top 20, and one of the coins I have... My largest, my largest position in my in my Binance account tied up in is PancakeSwap. I think this has a big future ahead of it. 
we can easily see by the end of the year a $200 um, pancake swap. That's a price prediction right there from me. $200 USD pancake swap by the end of the year, currently sitting at $28.12. Um, within a few months, I think this will be at 100 easily. Okay, so that's why I've got a big position in pancake swap. It's working, it's a working product. Everyone's using it, jumping over to PancakeSwap. There's YouTuber after YouTuber making uh, tutorials on how to use it. People are moving away from Uniswap currently because of the gas fees associated with Ethereum, which they are trying to fix. But so the PancakeSwap is their, is their go-to now. Until Uniswap, or it's not Uniswap's fault, but until Ethereum's gas fees are fixed over there, um, it, it's not gonna it's not gonna explode in in the sense that pancake and binance are exploding as soon as they are fixed and they're working on it it's meant to be fixed in july i think that's why i'm investing in ethereum and why i'm bullish on uniswap because from july onwards once this gets uh fixed if it does we should see an explosion also with ethereum and uniswap so they are the coins that I'm bullish on in the top 20. Cardano is definitely way up there as one of the coins that I favor the most within the top 10. Outside of the top 20, you saw right there, I am extremely bullish on uh, pancake swap on Cake. And uh, Cake's my biggest position in my Binance portfolio currently. I see it doing excellent things. I know we can make, uh, potentially you can jump on Dodge and make bigger percentage gains. You could also make massive losses on Dodge. Uh, Pancake Swap is is it's got traction, it's got momentum, it's a working product. Uh, it has a it has a use case. It's meaningful. It's 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 going places. It truly is. It's uh it's a it's a solid investment as far as cryptocurrency is concerned. Right now, you can probably behind Bitcoin. Bitcoin, uh, obviously, is a good investment. Is when you speak about cryptos, is it's, it's probably the least volatile out of all cryptos. Uh, Bitcoin, Ethereum, Binance, Pancakes. So you cannot currently get a uh, a more solid investment out of those four. I mean, and, and out of those four, as we speak, Pancake Swap out of those four is moving the quickest. Coming back, speaking about ADA, is because I think percentage wise. This has a potential. This has a momentum and, and potential to explode this year. That's why I'm bullish on on Cardano, um, and and it's just it's just going to do great things, in my opinion. It really is, along with Pancake Swap this year. So they're two of the coins within the top 100. Pancake Cardano that I'm most bullish on this year. And it, tell me what you think. Do you agree with me? Do you think Cardano is going to do great things? Do you think Pancake's going to do great things? We can already see Pancake doing great things. We saw Cardano doing great things. It's had a retrace because of the market. It's going to explode. It's my hedge against Ethereum. It's going to have a massive upside. I'm, I'm bullish on the whole market still. What's your thoughts and opinions? Hit me up on Twitter. The link is down below. Follow me on Twitter. Let me know what you think. I put my trades a lot of the time up on Twitter before I do here because obviously it's easier and quicker. But uh, let me know what you think. Hit that subscribe button. I'll see you again with a new video tomorrow.